can you pay for college? Can you afford college? 80% of the jobs in the world right now do not care if you have a degree or not. My passion has always been YouTube and I feel like college is taking a lot of time out of my day. I don't know if I am gonna make a business. So I got an email yesterday about my bill, like how much I'm gonna be paying. It's supposed to be $43,000. Good morning. No, I'm just kidding. It's like 5 p.m. right now. I don't know if you guys can see me. It's a little bit exposed, but I'm currently walking on the Oregon Hill Trail. I think that's what it's called. Today I'm going to be filming a video called, Is College Right For You? So, I gotta walk like two miles before I get to the bridge. It's a little bit scary trying to get down to where I need to get down to. There's the city and the bridge. It's right over there. And that's exactly where I'm going to film this video. I am currently walking on the bridge right now. It's really nice. It's really peaceful. See, I was gonna try to find a seating area for this video. I have no idea if I can find one, but look at this view. Look at this. It's so nice and peaceful here. tough time trying to film this video because this view is just so nice. It's also freaking hot today. It's like 88 degrees. I was gonna try to film it the other day, but it was like 97 degrees. I'm like, yeah, no, I'm good. I wonder what they're doing down there. This view right now, can't beat it. You really can't beat it. Also, my hair is like going everywhere. Okay, so I tried filming this video the other day in my dorm room, but I kind of realized that it was a little bit boring. So I ended up making notes for or like a script i ended up making a script for the video because i knew that i was gonna get off topic uh-huh found a bench let's sit here okay let's finally get to filming this video now i also like how it's in the shade too so i just get to rest <sighs> all right let's get on with the video so is college worth it or is college right for you that really all depends so the reason why i decided to go to college is because I wanted to start a business alongside my YouTube channel. Don't know if I'm really gonna do that. I don't know if I am gonna make a business. If you're kind of on the fence of going to college, just really think about it. Can you pay for college? Can you afford college? If you can, maybe college is an option for you. But if you can't afford to buy your own food or you can't afford to basically buy anything really, why go to college? because you're just putting yourself into more debt. So I got an email yesterday about my bill, like how much I'm gonna be paying for freshman year alone in college. And without financial aid, it's supposed to be $43,000. But with financial aid, it's still gonna be above $25,000 for freshman year, which is freaking insane, by the way. And I don't even know if college is even the right decision for me. And I'm having to already pay $25,000 for student loans freshman year alone by the way that's not even including sophomore junior and senior year that's just freshman year alone and by the way the twenty five thousand dollars the amount of money i have to pay for freshman year is after getting grants and after getting financial aid and any sort of financial help honestly if i didn't apply to college i'd probably not be in debt right now because yeah i'm in debt not even that I had to buy textbooks for two of my classes ended up costing over three hundred dollars and i can barely afford food and and I have a financial class every Monday, which is a personal financial class, which helps you financially and it helps you plan out your future financially. Yet they are charging me or they're charging us, whoever's in the class, they're charging us $100 a month for a financial planning software, which makes absolute no sense because you're supposed to help us financially. Yet you're making us pay for a course that will bring us into more debt after college which is crazy. Sorry, I really wanted to film near the river, but it was gonna be way too windy and way too loud. So I'm here in the more peaceful area and it's less noisy. Another reason why I came to college is because of the security factor. Uh, people go to college so then they know for sure that they can get a job. 80% of the jobs in the world right now, or at least in America, there's a bug. 80% of the jobs in America right now do not care if you have a degree or not. While the 20% of jobs still do care, like if you're a doctor or a nurse or any sort of engineering job or a lawyer, 
those you still need a degree for that and you still need a major you still need a just education but 80 percent of the jobs nowadays do not care like youtube for example youtube you don't need a degree to make youtube videos whatsoever you just start doing you like me i started doing youtube back what the summer leading into my senior year of high school and i'm still doing youtube and i enjoy making youtube videos but i'm in college right now getting a degree or thought i was getting a degree not sure if i'm still gonna get a degree yet my passion has always been youtube and i feel like college is taking a lot of time out of my day to make youtube videos and to perfect it so the pros of going to college getting a degree basically if you have a degree you're like you're set for your future and you already know that you can get some sort of okay these freaking cicadas what is i don't know if i finished my thought or not but i guess a positive thing about going to college is that you can get a degree and you can get some sort of education so then you can kind of be set for your life and know exactly what you want to do in your life okay let me actually try looking at my script so i know exactly what to talk about because i'm like no information is in my head right now one of the pros of going to college is you can get a higher paying job. Statistics show that when people actually further their education and get some sort of degree, they can actually get a really, really good job and a really high paying job, while people who aren't in college really struggle to get a high paying job. There are ways to get a high paying job. It'll just take a little bit more effort and it'll be a lot more work in order to actually make some sort of money. Another pro is that you can actually have more time to decide what you want to do in your future. You have the next four years to decide what you want to do with your future. Whether you focus on your studies and get a degree, or what you can do because you're technically alone when you're in college, what you can do is you can figure out the stuff that you actually want to do in your future that doesn't involve school, and you can put more time and effort. Like me, I'm putting more time and effort into making videos than I am towards school, which is not what my family members want to hear, but I really enjoy making YouTube videos and YouTube has always been a passion of mine. And I've been able to pump out so many videos, well, so many as in like, I've been able to pump out three videos since I've been here versus when I'm at home. I just feel lazy when I'm at home. I feel like I don't want to do anything. And there's also nothing to do at home. So that's why I wanted to be in this city so I can actually do something. You kind of have like a four year security net or like a buffer where you can spend those four years and really experiment. And then another pro was a security factor, which I already talked about that because when you go to college you're guaranteed to get oh you're guaranteed to get some sort of a degree which will land you a high paying job so that's a security factor the cons of going to college it's expensive it's really expensive as i said earlier in the video i am now over $25,000 in student loan debt another con is that it's completely different from high school what i mean by that is when you're in high school you go to classes and the teachers actually teach you stuff Versus when you're in college, I feel like they tell you to buy textbooks and then teach yourself. They will tell you to like read pages X from X or whatever and then you have to like take notes down and you have to study. They make you spend a ton of money on textbooks so then you can read it and then take notes down and you kind of have to teach yourself. Another con is that I feel like college is somewhat of a gamble, especially now. Some degrees can land you a high paying job, other degrees can land you a low paying job for example engineer you can land a high paying job and you will get a return on your investment biology you become a doctor or a nurse you can land such a high paying job a lawyer definitely a high paying job but fine arts any sort of fine arts job you're really taking a gamble because you don't know if you're gonna actually get paid that much money the college that I'm currently in fine arts people actually pay more tuition than how much I pay other people are in like 30 plus thousand dollar debt right now who are in the performing fine arts or whatever but when they actually get a job they're gonna average maybe thirty thousand dollars a year which is not much at all but you're paying so much money for college tuition and you're not even gonna land a high paying job like what i don't understand is why would you go to school to learn how to film or to learn how to take photos I feel like you can easily do that, especially nowadays. You can easily use your phone and learn how to take pictures and learn how to um, take cinematography videos and professional shooting videos. Like, I love filming. I could have easily majored in film, but I decided to major in business because they make more money. But I'm putting myself into a deep money pit right now. And then another con is you get less time to do things. So I'm in school. I have homework. I go to lectures. I get less time to really film. Yo, there's a bulldog. 
No, I'm missing it. It's over there. Yo. I don't see a bulldog out in the wild like that. People have always tried to doubt me in making YouTube videos. I feel like my only supporters really that I have are my parents and then my true friends. I feel like everyone else has been kind of doubting me on my YouTubing stuff because they want me to succeed in life. They don't want me to, you know, make YouTube videos and then struggle trying to pay bills. I get it. I just want to pursue this YouTube thing because I, I really enjoy making YouTube videos. I feel like I have freedom. While other jobs, I feel like you're kind of stuck on this 9 to 5. So I guess in summary, is college right for you? Well, if you want to be a doctor, lawyer, nurse, engineer, yes, go to college. Or maybe business, sure, go to college. If you want to be anything else, don't go to college. End of story. That's it. That's so peaceful. That's so peaceful.